Hi, Coralie Coleman, Come Alive Coach here. We're starting a new series today on managing stress. My experience with stress, stress <laughs> took a 180 degree turn to the better when I finally acknowledged I actually had stress. Stress hadn't even been in my vocabulary. Here I was, all about coaching, about coming alive, about focusing on hope and heading towards positive directions. But no, let's not talk about stress that I'm experiencing. However, my journey to reverse diabetes led me deep into my subconscious messages that I was getting in my way. It was old baggage. If you have read any of my Come Alive book series, you know I call those subconscious messages from your past blank spots. Eventually, in successfully working on my blank spots and getting in my way of healing, it became clear that additional deep feelings about past and current situations were creating stress. It made my journey very difficult. Thus begin my exploring what is stress. Well, Merriam-Webster defines the kind of stress I'm talking about as a physical, chemical, or emotional factor that causes bodily and mental te tension. Stress can be good stress or not so good stress. Good stress is about experiences that are within your ability to manage, generally short-lived, and can be exciting or fun. Setting a goal you are passionate about can be an example of good stress. Not so good stress is something that may be out of your wheelhouse to manage. It could be about a situation that brings anxiety and concern. All in all, this type of stress feels unpleasant. So if you want more information about stress, watch part two coming up next week. And check out my website at CoralieComan.com for more resources. Thank you.